Hey everyone, welcome to my channel, Living Free with Little. My name is Debbie. Just going out and seeing what's starting to bloom. Look at that grass is coming, starting to come. I'm going to take my walk like I always do. I try to come out here and see, you know, what changed each time. And I'm going to head up front. I'm just, I'm start, uh, I'm looking for certain things on the ground before I go in. And I just thought to share it with you guys. All right, stay tuned. All right, so I thought the videotape, this is where I'm seeing all the, the walnuts, the black walnuts, which I'm starting to see right here, the shell. Let me see. See how the shell is? It looks like that, it looks like that inside. There's tons of them here. Now I'm gonna have to keep an eye on it. That's what it looks like inside. I don't know if these are, like I said, edible, like if they're hay, um, hickory. Because they said it depends. Um, what kind of tree it is, whatever. So this is how I'm going to try to identify. They said something about the, um, the bark. So this looks like not the good kind um, black walnuts. Um, or it's a hickory. If someone knows by just, I think it's this one that's dropping everything. So the only way we're going to find out is when it starts blooming and then I'll check it out again. But I, I didn't add this when I went um, foraging on my land, looking out, you know, to try to identify things. Um, it's a shame because this is wrapped in there. Look how I can't even get that off, whatever is wrapped around it. But um, this is what the bark looks like um, from the one straight under. But it kind of looks, that one's real dark. That's a dark brown. You see it? Let me see if I can get a little closer. See, that's darker. This is more grayer. So the only thing I could think of, I mean, it could be also that tree. Let me go over there real quick. I want, I have to look down, so I'm going to pause this for a minute. Well, I was looking down. That's how big the other one was. See how they're cracked already? Yeah. So let me go over here and let me check. I really don't think it's this one. Um, see, this is that's the bark of that one. It's coming out. I don't even know what kind of tree that. If anyone can identify it just by looking at, it. I'll wait till it blooms too. But if you can just tell off the bat, there's a lot of people can. Because I don't see no droppings of any kind of. Not over here on the ground. So. You know, I'll start looking farther. I think it's right, since it's right in this area, I'm thinking it's that tree right there. It's doing it. <clears throat> A lot of thorns back here too. They attack you. Now see, there's some shells here. Yeah, I'm gonna have to identify. I, I don't know where these are coming from. You know, I mean, the squirrels, I mean, trust me, squirrels can like, see, this one is still closed. They never opened it up. See it? Um, they said come out at a certain time to actually gather these up before, because they'll, they'll, they can go tart. But first, I have to identify which one it is, because that's another source that's on my land that I can actually use, because they said something about um, the black walnut that doesn't have the, like, it looks like it could peel. Like this one, these are intact. Um, he mentioned the name of it. Um, like it's flaky. Oh, I'm just looking now. If the skin's like really flaky, that's the good <clears throat> walnuts. It looks kind of like... Oh, here I go again. Look, watch guys. Look how pretty they are. Look. <laughs> you can tell everything's turning green. It looks like kind of like this. Oh my God. It might be this one. I don't know. And there is. Look. <laughs> OMG, guys. Look. Just walking out here. There is a walnut or hazelnut, which now I have to identify. Look at the shell. And they said you have to fight it, but it's this is the kind of um, work they have. I think I, this either a hickory or it's a black walnut, but I think it's hickory. All right. I hear something in, in the woods. 
this is what that one looks like and then you have this one that I think has the black walnut or the, the hickory so now <laughs> yeah but this is exactly what he said that you could tell the difference from the black walnut the good black walnut and also I think because the, the hickory I have to look it up now because we I have one over there look that's all damaged up so yeah oh yeah you know I'm gonna be out here all these trees that are grown back here I didn't even know about this is one thing I have to learn the trees I'm not really good at so I have to learn these but I think this might be I want to find out it's either a hickory or a black walnut but it's they don't look black they look like they're just regular walnuts so it could be hickory the good kind because they said there there's a black walnut the guy said that no the haze the, the yeah the hickory and they said this is the good kind and then this one's not but you can use it to uh smoke your meats you put it in in a pan and you uh you have to wet them let them soak in water throw them in, in it like a foil pan or some kind put foil on top and then poke holes in it and put it you know how when you're you're cooking on a grill you cook it on there and then it'll um the hickory goes right into your meats it's another good way to know as a prepper um standards that yeah see i want to show you the difference of the color this is the shell of this one looks like and then the other shells of that one i'm really excited so if you guys know what this is please let me know and uh be very appreciative because I'm trying to learn all this stuff and I know the squirrels they said you have to get out here before the squirrels so I have to know when to get out here and grab them before anything happens so all right guys if you like this video give me a thumbs up and if you're not sub please sub to me and hit that notification bell for future videos because well today was a good day I'm